Hey everybody, it's Alan, and I hope you are doing well. So I was going to do this video as a two or a three for one video, but I've chosen not to because frankly, I didn't want to hear that obnoxious rednecks version of it. And I really didn't want to hear the countrified version of it either. So um, we're going to listen to the song Cotton Eye Joe, but we're going to listen to the Nina Simone version. Where do you come from? And where do you go? Where do you come from? My cotton eye, Jill. Well, I come for to see you, and I come for to say, and I come for to show you my diamond ring. Where do you come from? And where If it hadn't been for If it hadn't been for Old Cotton Eye Now, I'm sure many people here watching this are very familiar with the Rednecks version of it. Um, that obnoxious dance groove beat from the 90s, or actually early 80s, I think, or mid-80s. Mid-80s, whenever the heck that stupid thing was out. It just, I don't know. It just, it was a silly song. And I know... Music isn't always meant to be serious. Uh, I get that. That's fine. But it was just really obnoxious. And then I went back and, of course, afterward listened to some of the original versions or the previous versions of that. I think um, especially a lot of the country music versions like Asleep at the Wheels version or, or, or even older versions. And I was like, God, this song is just really, ugh. And I couldn't quite understand how it became standardized. Now, bear in mind, this is years and years and years ago, but I, I just didn't quite get it. I didn't get the appeal to the song. Then I heard the Nina Simone version of it, and I'm like, holy crap, that is incredibly classy. And no matter how, which version of it you like, the song could be represented in many a different way. And, and I personally prefer the Nina Simone version. It's, it's just got that really beautiful voice and that incredibly soulful piano playing of hers that just set to that nice, slow, smooth jazz shuffle. And you get really, uh, um, 
a song that will transport you into sort of a different mindset. And again, it completely contradicts the silliness of the other versions or the countryfied version. It's just, uh, I love this version. And um, that's just my perspective. So hope you enjoyed this. Please feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below. We could talk about it further. Just know that I appreciate all of you and I wish you well. Take care.